welcome to Crescente Interviews. I'm Joel Stewart and this is... Kim Cicilliano. Hello, Kim. How are you? Who are you? What do you do? Hi, Joel. I'm Kim Cicilliano and I'm the Women and Family Services Director here at the YWCA. The Women and Family Services Director. What does that mean? It means that I oversee the housing program as well as our domestic violence uh, services program. Domestic violence services? What sort of services are we talking about? Okay, so we do counseling, we do advocacy, we work with child protective services to make sure we keep victims safe and their children. Uh, we have housing for domestic violence victims in our shelter as well as we have housing after they come out of shelter in our transitional housing programs. So you got a lot of uh, services for people dealing with domestic violence situations. Mm -hmm. How does somebody um, notify you if they need assistance in this way. Okay, so if somebody is dealing with a domestic violence situation, we have a hotline number. Um, we are the certified uh, registered and um, licensed provider of domestic violence services, so you would call 374-3386 and that gets you right to our domestic violence shelter and you will speak directly with a case manager who can help you walk through the next steps as to what you should do to get out of the situation you're in. If you know somebody who needs assistance, can, you can also... Can you can call on behalf of that person and get some information, but we really do like to hear from the victims themselves so we can really um, give them advice and hear what they want to do to make sure that we're steering them in the right direction. Earlier you said there were some other things that are going on here at the YWCA. Uh, one of our big events coming up in September, September 29th, we're having a trivia contest um, which is open to the public. The community can be involved. Uh, everybody can participate. We are looking for teams of four, people who know trivia, who like to play trivia. Um, and it will be at the Van Dyke right down the street here in the nice stockade area. Then I did want to plug um, October, which is our Domestic Violence Awareness Month as well as Breast Cancer Awareness Month. And we do a whole plethora of activities that happen during that month. Um, from our Take Back the Night March to Week Without Violence to we do, uh, we bedazzle bras so we let the communities welcome to come in and decorate bras. We do lots of different activities to bring awareness to the need to end domestic violence and to prevent um, breast cancer. So um, October, that happens, wear your purple, wear your pink and come on down in October and participate in our activities then. So, if you are, have never had the opportunity to stop by here and see the space and some of the wonderful people that work here and the uh, things that you can get involved in, then you can stop by on June 20th, where Crescente will be playing uh, from 7.30 to 9 p.m. It's a free concert. Come on by. Limited space available. Check it out. Kim, thank you very much for your time. Thank you, Joel, for having me and also for coming and presenting us with a great concert. We can't wait to have you here. All right. Hope to see you there. Bye. Bye.